It's time now for our Athlete of the Week, and it's brought to you by Diamond Point and Sock Center. We have a Melrose athlete with us for our Athlete of the Week. This is Mitch Rutter for the Melrose Dutchman. Hey, congratulations on what you've been able to do so far. Thank you. All right. Talk about, uh, first of all, who's in your family so we can get all the Rellers straight. Okay. Well, I got my brother, Evan. Then on the baseball team, is my cousin, Ty. Then I got a few cousins that are playing the girls basketball team mm -hmm. so we had a lot in our same grade and who are your parents mark and leah okay because there always seems to be confusion with it is <laughs> so which reller is out there right now and who is who, who is his that's uh, ty reller at first base and his dad would be russ okay real good well I'll talk about uh, you are a pitcher on the baseball team what i want to ask you is uh how you doing out there? Uh, talk about your approach to pitching and what you try to accomplish out there with the pitches that you throw. Well, I try to get up there and get ahead, usually with the fastball, and then work off speed from there and stay ahead. Mm -hmm. How's the breaking pitch? Uh, it's getting better. I've been working on it a lot lately, so yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. You know, you've been a pretty good thrower for so long. I, I can remember when you were a young kid. Talk about the, the history of how you've come along in a baseball player. When did you first start to play, and what have you done? Well, we started really young and probably like fourth fifth grade and traveling team then really worked on it from there all the way up to school ball in seventh and eighth grade just keep progressing until you got to the varsity level mm -hmm. i have to bring up basketball too if you don't mind okay <laughs> because you are the starter on that team that was rated number one in the state can you think back now after you've kind of stepped off the court here for a while what do you think of when you think back to that uh, basketball season that melrose had you just realize how fun it was and how great of an experience and all the fans that came to support it was awesome yeah, you had some exciting games, didn't you? Yep, some good ones. Long Prairie was a member one, the game winner, BB, the big crowd. Yeah, all right. So now high school is kind of wrapping up for you this baseball season. It's uh, kind of going short here for you. But what about the, any plans out of, after high school? Well, this summer I plan to play with the Freeport Black Sox, and then next year I'm going to play try to play baseball at Morris, see how that goes. Okay, where at Morris? Yes. Oh, is that right? Now, who's down there? How did you get attracted down there? Well, my brother plays basketball down there. Then I filled out a recruiting form, and they contacted me, and mm -hmm. they came watch the game last week. So, how is your brother doing? He's doing good. Yeah, what does he do down there? He plays uh, basketball, and he's going to major in uh, elementary teaching, I think. Okay, so uh, when you go down there, uh, that should be a lot of fun. It's a good place to be. All right. <laughs> Well, thanks for being with us as the Athlete of the Week. You continue on, and good success, and, uh, and congratulations again. That basketball season, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, well, thanks for having me. All right, that's Mitch Rutter, who is our Athlete of the Week here on MidMinnesotaSports.com, and it's been brought to you by Diamond Point in Sock Center.